Hey everyone, today I've got a cool program to show you called Grapple. And this program was developed by Cactos. Um, it's still in a sort of early alpha stage at the moment. Um, but I'll leave a link to the website, the download, the source, um, Cactos's Twitter, and the original Reddit post. Um, so you can keep up to date with his development of the program. But what this program essentially allows you to do is to host a server without actually port forwarding. And this has been possible in the past through programs that create a VPN such as Hamachi. Um, but this program is very lightweight and there's no install and it only requires the host to download it. And this doesn't just work with Minecraft, which is the very cool thing. It works with any game. You just need the port number. Um, so what I'm going to actually do now is I was going to host a server um, but I'm actually going to turn this single player world, so I'm going to open it to LAN and then open it further into a sort of public um, server which anyone can join given the right IP. So I'm going to open it to LAN, start LAN world, and then I'm given a port number down here, 49591, and I'm going to run the grapple client. This is going to give me a port um, input, so for, what was it again? 49591, 49591, click OK. Here's the Grapple client, really simple interface. It gives you the global address, which is the IP that you need to give other people. It gives you the sort of server port that you've hosted it on. Um, it gives you the number of connected clients. And a very cool feature is the sent data and received data. Um, so if you're on like a data plan or anything like that, you can keep track of how much data you've spent and everything like that. So now I'm going to have Bucky attempt to join this single player world. Hopefully it works. And there, she's joined. So I've just opened up a single player world into a sort of public server which anyone given the IP can, can join. And um, this program at the moment is free. Um, the only way it's being kept alive and the bandwidth is being paid for is by donations. So I believe if you donate to um, Cactos to keep the sort of program alive and pay for all the bandwidth and everything, you can um, get a dedica dedicated uh, Grapple I.O. port. Um, but yeah, I thought this was a really cool um, program to show off and... I hope that other people find it useful. It's definitely going to be useful for me, for other games. I usually just port forward anyway, but for games like um, Terraria or The Ship, where port forwarding isn't, doesn't always work as easily as it does with Minecraft. But I just want to show you a cool little way that you can use this to open up a single player world into um, a multiplayer server. But I'll leave the, a link to the download and all of that in the description, so make sure you check it out. Um, but anyway, that's all from me for this video, um, and I'll see you next time. Hopefully I'll have an update video for uh, Lost Among the Dead, as well as the Legend of Zelda map that I'm making.